Here we are again with another anime reaction, and this time Isekai Oji-san. Yeah, Isekai Oji-san is an anime that grabbed my interest this season because I like Isekai anime. But this anime is an Isekai with a twist, where basically the main protagonist comes back from an Isekai world, apparently. So, instead of going to an Isekai world, he comes from one. And, yeah, I guess this is interesting to see how this will turn out. So, I would say, without further ado, let's get right into it. Truck-kun got another one. <laughs> 17 years. You woke. He escaped the grasp of death from Trakun. He had gone insane. He talks some gibberish. No shit, yeah, Japanese. <laughs> yeah, he's not buying it. <laughs> He's absolutely not buying it. And she's just like, yeah, whatever you say, have a great day. <clears throat> I'm glad you're feeling well. Oh. Damn. Makes a note of it. Oh, he wants to prove it. Let's see what he does. Self-reliance support. Wind lift. I guess it does what it says. Imagine you go into an Isekai world, come back and you have your powers that you learned over there. <laughs> nah. I didn't want to hit you with the harsh reality for a self-reliance support. <laughs> oh oh, <laughs> console wars on Sega. Oh boy, <laughs> I have to tell you something, Oji-san. <laughs> and another note and another line. <laughs> Spell to erase memory. Oh my god, he had so many lines. Sega's decline must be truly heart wrenching. He loves the Sega. <laughs> 60,000 yen from ads. That's around 600 bucks. Well,. With today's economy, not really. <laughs> the art style is very interesting. Because it looks like... It looks really drawn. But it's, it somehow reminds me of, as if they took a photo from something. And then just redraw it. Yeah, what were they like? I mean, that's part of every isekai. Solo for 17 years, okay. Another twist. Imagine being so like truly solo the whole time? Yep. <laughs> Easy guy world, everyone looks good. Holy shit, what? What? <laughs> Come on, he, he isn't ugly or something. What? They followed him? Is she a tsundere? I mean, it sounds like a tsundere. <laughs> Man, I love the expressions in this anime. They look so good. Tsundere, four years later. <laughs> Dude, he's... he's dead inside. Weefy. <laughs> oh my god, the comments. LOL. Elmao. Nopa. 
Is this true? Does old phones have outdated radio waves? I didn't know that if, if that's true. Yeah, I remember that in my childhood. If you had like a flip phone or some shit, that was the good stuff. Yeah, in these 17 years, like from 2000 to now, so much technology happened. Oh! He can recall his memories with this and show others? That's handy. <clears throat> That's like a dash cam. <laughs> I don't think so from what he said so far. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, is this a girl? Bent on harassing me. He's out. He's like, I'm out of here. Took the chance. What? He, he can do it because he heard of smartphones? And what was that running animation? Yeah, she's... Seems really like it's some, some there. Eh? Place the last bit. Shipping? How much is it? <laughs> What's more than the phone? No, he's not. He can fly? <laughs> Dude, he went straight up Super Saiyan. Couch? <laughs> if it's for a massage, then I can do it. Free shipping? <laughs> yeah, here I have a knife. The legendary Dragon Slayer. <laughs> Very handy. <laughs> it becomes Ein's old gown. Can you sell it? A tassel. 50 yen? Maybe some unknown stuff and they just think, yeah, that's trash. <laughs> Thirty years of which seventeen are in Isekai world where he was solo the whole time. <clears throat> Sonic and Tails. <laughs> His Sega addiction. I never was a fan of Sonic and Tails. It was all about Mario for me and Nintendo and a bit of Sony. Not bad, one slice. Not bad at all. <laughs> His appearance again, they think he's ugly, he's an orc. Oh no, an orc killed another orc and now he wants to kill us. <laughs> he must be the leader. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> うん。どう見ても自分を犠牲にして男の子が守ろうとしていた。いい感じだろ。でもこの直後。Very the episode. <laughs> uh. Oh, oh. <laughs> 
Really? <laughs> you, just, you saved my life. You have some money for the ring I just gave you that you really liked. Is this why she was pissed about him? Because of, because of the ring? <laughs> A video idea. 20 million? Dude, that, that must be decent money, I would imagine. 20 million views, uh, 2, mil 2 million views. Imagine suddenly the black hole or whatever closes and he stabs him for real. That would be brutal. My not isekai life with my OG son began. Okay, this was episode 1 of Isekai OG san and I must say I really like it. Um, I wasn't a fan of the drawing style at the beginning because it looked a bit rough around the edges, but over the course of the episode I really started to like it, and I especially liked the expressions of the character. <laughs> they had some really good funny expressions going on, um, and I think it's a very interesting uh, story so far because it's not an Isekai, but like a reverse isekai where you don't go into an isekai world but you come from an isekai world which is a first for me i don't know if there's an a different anime where someone comes from isekai world and, that, and that's what it all what it's all about so i think this might be a first maybe i don't know um but yeah it's very interesting and i can't wait to see where it's going because i think it's very hard to tell where it's going i guess it's just like a slice of life anime basically where it's just like it goes from day to day, basically, or day to week, whatever. And it might not have really a goal. Like in other animes, you have like a goal, like One Piece, you want to find the One Piece. And that's the end, basically. But here it's like open-ended, I would say, and there's no real goal. Um, but besides that, what I'm wondering about is, is, the, is the elf girl, that Tsundere elf girl, which we don't know the name of by, uh, so far, um, I'm wondering why she helped him because it seems like when he got knocked out by the kids and she like bandaged him up it seems like that was their first encounter um, because it seems like that Oji-san didn't, didn't knew her so why is she helping him when if she didn't like him but I mean she's a tsundere so she must like him for some reason but i'm wondering why so far because she like expresses her sundere traits by saying that she isn't liking him and that you shouldn't misunderstand and all that stuff so i'm interested to see why she helped him and where that is going <laughs> um but yeah it's like <laughs> uh, i wonder if she started to follow him because of the ring thing Maybe she misunderstood. I don't know. I, I mean, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I guess I have to wait for the next episodes. But yeah, like I said, good episode. I really enjoyed it. Definitely want to watch more of it. And yeah, thanks for watching. And till next time, hopefully. If you liked the video, leave a comment, subscribe, leave a like, whatever. Uh, I would really appreciate it. But yeah, thanks for watching. Till next time. Bye-bye.